Hey, welcome back guys. So, I have a lot of videos that I want to put out and I can't put it out because my computer is dead. I have all these computer parts sitting here for so long, case and everything. I guess, I don't know. I just have to take the time and build it now because like, the other one's full. Excuse you. The other one is holding my videos hostage and she's holding me hostage. I can't put her down and I can't go anywhere. As soon as I come home, this is it. And she had two needles today, so she's a little bit cranky. Hmm. So what I got here is first, let me start with the MSI, what is it? MSI Carbon Gaming Pro Carbon Motherboard. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Then I got some G-Skill RAM DDR4, mm -hmm. I think 32 gigs. Ryzen 7, I'm usually an Intel guy, but I'm gonna try the Ryzen, I hear it's good for editing. So I'm gonna try that. West End Digital Hard Drive, I'm also going to get a solid state to put the windows on. This is just for storage. And the MSI 79, what is it? A 79, 7970. It's used because I'm trying to buy a brand new 1060, but the, because of Bitcoin and this um, crypto mining, prices just went through the roof of the card. So this one I bought from a friend, it's gonna have to last me for now. And then we got this massive CPU cooler. Look at the size of this thing. Look at her, <laughs> look at the size of this thing for the little tiny little processor that's in here. We're gonna be cooling. And then we got this massive oh, 800 watt power, sorry, 850 watt power supply. We won't be short of power, no way. And then gotta, I have a Corsair Air 540K. It's, it's a massive one. Cause I did plan on doing some water cooling, but I don't have the time right now. I got so much work to do on cars, it's, it's just nuts. And Miss Thing here is taking over my life. I love her to death. My daddy wants to make some videos. Right? Right? Yeah, as long as you're sitting there. As long as she's sitting here, she's good. The moment I put her down, wine city. But I guess she just misses me. Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> Say hi there. I'm gonna see if I can put her down so I can start this. Uh, don't hold your breath, so whenever this gets done, because I need my, all my other videos from my computer so I can finish editing them and start posting. I guess that's it for me. Uh, all right, sheesh. Just look at this setup. Always gonna look so good when it's done. So this is the Corsair case I was telling you about. I was gonna do her. Uh oh, I just realized, why is it that I'm doing so much red? I was going to, I don't think I'm gonna do it anymore. And red is not my favorite color, but you know what? Whoa, time to start. Ooh, look at this baby. It's a lot of shadow from the light, but wow, look at that. Man, so I'm gonna open everything up and then start assembly. Now let's see if I remember how to build a computer. It's been a while, but it's like riding a bike. Look at that, what oh, a reflex is like a cat. So, take the side off. Wow, they really pack this stuff. I guess this is where one of the hard drive goes, so where is that hard drive? There it is. This would go in here, I hope. Just like that, and that slides. There you go, it's all clicked in. I guess the cables will go through there, but I'm gonna, wait, let me take the other side off too. Okay, I don't know where nothing goes in this, so I'm gonna have to pull out the manual because there is a lot of cables. Just look how they, they, they package this thing. I mean, <laughs> wow, they really, after I took it out of the box and all the plastic, this is how it comes. These guys don't joke around at all. So let's see how, and look at all the pieces, the modular. So you just, if you don't need it, you don't plug it in. You don't only plug in the one you need. This is what you call quality right here. Well, that's in there. And it's like, good thing there, this is in two sections where you can hide all the wires behind, it, behind here. You don't see it over there. This little backing plate will go here. I'll do all that afterwards and that will hold the power supply in. You just line up with one of the screw holes, put it in. Wow, this thing even comes with an extra pouch to carry all the extra cables around. Just in case, you know, I don't know, you want to 
plug something in later when you transport in this thing around don't ask me so I'm gonna secure that and then the, I'm gonna put the CD the DVD drive hmm I put it here here I think I'll put it on the outside I'm gonna put that in and I'm gonna see what else I uh, get start putting the motherboard in put the processor on the motherboard and all that stuff so now we grab this and the CPU big ass box and it's just in the what? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Uh, of course I dropped it. Good thing it's well packed. Uh, I'm just a clerk. So not, don't drop it because right now a lot of people are going to be swearing and ranting and raving. I used to build PC. We drop shit all the time. No. It's after you take it out there, you don't want to drop it. You don't want to be touching the top either, so you grab it by the sides. Gently open it. Grab it by the side. And you can see there's a little, come on, a little dirty ass hands, a little gold arrow right there. It will line up with the motherboard right down there. So you lift this up and find my blind ass eyes. Wow. And then, oh, you know what, let me line this up first because this looks kind of freaky. I think this is the way it goes. You will know because you don't have to push it down. See there, it just sits on it. Once you put it in, it just sits. Then you lock it in. And yeah, it doesn't fall out. I put my hand there just in case because the last thing you want this thing to do is fall. And then, because once one of the pins bent, that's it, it's no good. It's in, touch with my hand, I'm going to clean it up and then I'm gonna put on two little drops of this to help transfer the heat to the cooler. Well, as usual, I run into a problem. So this monstrosity here, the backing plate that uh, holds the CP, the, the fan on here to cool the CPU is the wrong backing plate. So I call the manufacturer, no problem. The problem is we just, we just ran out, but all you have to do is pay the shipping, $17 US from Germany, from Germany. So now I have to wait like two weeks, I'm not going to wait two weeks. So I went out and I got water cooled. Yeah, so now I'm just going to have this one sitting here. Maybe I can sell it, maybe I can build something else with it, who knows. But now this is going to go back into the box. I'm gonna list it. It's a great cooler if it doesn't sell and I probably just use it in another system. But for now, we're gonna go water cool. And man, assembly required. So this is a Captain 360EX. Wow, I can't wait to install this stuff. Yeah, baby. So I'm gonna get stop talking. I'm gonna start assembling everything because we have the radiator here. With uh, look at that, it is um, so you're gonna be able to see the liquid, the fluid going through. But some assembly required. Wow, and I can't go through every detail on installing this because that's gonna take forever. And I'm not really a computer. No, not. I was, I'm not really, I used to build them, but that's not what this channel is about. It's about, yeah, it's about modding. We're gonna do a little bit of modding here, but I, I'm not gonna go through step-by-step -step detail in this one. Maybe in another episode, maybe not, who knows? But for now, assembly required. I got my 16 gigs of RAM here. I got 32 gigs, 16 here, 16 there. And this little notch here, and this little notch here, you can only put it in one way. It's like they call it idiot proof. You can't get it in wrong because if you turn the other way, it will not go in. You just make sure this slot line up with that slot and then uh, you just put them in. So you put one here, pull those back, pop it in, push it down and both ends will click. Just like that. Grab the other one. Come on. And you do the same thing. Open them up.
click click Bob's your uncle and let me see if I can show it to you guys here on the motherboard right here uh, lighting's not good it actually shows you how to put the RAM in which one to put in first because it, it shows you first that slot and that slot first and uh, RAM's in I can't put the cooler on until I put it in the case because it's gonna be awkward moving around with it so I'm gonna take this and clean some of the stuff off my desk and then put it in the case grab this just put some thermal paste in the middle and then now here comes the fight of putting this thing on because of these hoses make sure it's put evenly and there you go it's installed now when i have my fans in here put those away under there and i should be good to go i hope i don't have to turn this thing around because there's just too many screws in this thing to move to install the video card we take out two of these little backing plates because it's it's a double plate back here we grab this we slide it in and it clicks in there you go it clicks in and then we put the two screws back in here and that's how easy it is to install a video card so after all this is screwed in we just find the power supplies we plug them in plug them in the back make sure all the cpu fan and everything is plugged in because you don't want this baby to overheat let's see if it turns on and let's see what happens oh where is it there you go oh nope gotta turn it on first there you go It's alive! Look at the heartbeat. It's just pouncing. Look at that. And it should come on over here any minute now. And, oh, look at that. There it is. And it's getting ready to put windows on. So now I'm just gonna put windows on and get it up and running and get some more lights going in there. Cause you know, as you can see, I didn't decide to go red, but the motherboard coming all the red stuff on it already, so I might as well continue the theme. Isn't she beautiful? Just look at that. Getting ready to edit. Well, there you go. Me starting editing already, building the machine. But there's one final look at it. Uh, not final, there's more to come, but I got too much more videos to do for cars, so I'm not gonna be messing around with this too much more for now. I'll do, do the rest later. And uh, more much to come for the computer. <laughs> Computer is done. Now I can start editing all these videos that it was holding hostage. And trust me, this thing is quick. I'm quite pleased the way it turned out. Uh, but enough messing around with that. Time to get back to the videos. And I have a new car I'm also working on. And no, it's not a BMW. It's something else. I remember a while back, I told you there's gonna be a new car. Well, I have it in the garage, getting ready to do some videos, but now I can edit them. We're gonna leave this one here. Um, if you guys have any, quest, have any questions about what I use in here, I'm gonna try and list them, but I got so much to do, I don't know if I'm gonna have time listing them. But I'm gonna try and list them. And uh, if you got any questions, give me a shout. If you like what you see, subscribe. Um, there's a lot more to come with cars, computer, probably some house. Who knows what we're gonna be doing. And a lot more cute baby girl to come to because I ain't getting rid of her, as you can see. She's just, she's all over. But love her for that. Uh, somebody gotta love this mug uh, shut up Louise that's it for now and uh, consider subscribing and share like thumbs up you know all that great stuff and get this channel growing because we got lots more to do so that's it for now laters